Hi guys, welcome to our third episode of this Sunday special and we actually had our breakfast and lunch together and we decided to just go out and look for some drinks and some sweets and we couldn't really think about this cafe because we decided to just go around Rayon and just chill and done with our pastries and our uh, tea and coffee and now we are seated here outside the veranda for some photos and at the back is the Hotel Fantari so it has a nice location because uh, later you will see we will cross the road and then straight onto the beach and they have a nice location because there's also a restaurant a Thai restaurant that we also went to with some of our friends a few years back and it has a really nice vibe when it's evening because of the light so I think we're gonna go see the beach right there will be like a, a, what do you call that like a beach breaker like they put rocks so that the rocks will form like a like a I don't know what's the term for that in geographical terms but yeah it will have loads of nice photo options if you come over and please wear a slipper okay because it's nice to walk on the beach in this kind of setup. So guys, this is the beach looks like. This is just like a front of the cafe. How beautiful it is, guys, right? Yeah. So we are just on the road and this is the cafe. That we just had our chilling moment and that is the hotel guys just so beautiful and that's where we park our car <laughs> beautiful That is the restaurant that we have been to. We ate here a couple of times with some of our friends. It's also nice, nice vibe at night with all the lights. So let's go over that side. Yep. We'll go, oops, it's sandy and I'm wearing shoes and I'm sinking in sand. Okay, let's go. Ta-da. Let's go. Sinking in sand. Oops, my gosh. I am sinking in sand. Guys, did you see? That is the Mataput area. It's near our place. Or actually, look, the place is really nice, guys. With the, the seawall. There. It's cool, right? It has like mini cape. I don't know, is that a cape or a mini? Yeah, I think it's a cape. There's a kid playing in the water. Okay, we're gonna go straight on to the rocks. And I'm going to pan the camera all the way 360 degrees from here. 
Okay. By the way, guys, if you're new to this channel, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notification button so that you will be updated of every vlog that we will be uploading on our channel. Right, guys, we're gonna go to the mall just for the sake of aircon, but I'll oh, tell you nice. what, this one is a mangrove preservation by Rayong and anyone can go in because they've got planks and you can do your jog inside there. I don't know if you can see it from here, but they're like planks. That's cool, man. Yep. This one is the one Bellinis. I want, Bellinis. I want to go in there, but since we stopped over at Cantari Cafe, no need to have another round of sweets. So we're gonna go chill inside the mall. Uh, inside, what's the name of Passion Mall before? Uh, Lemtong. Lem yes, inside Lemtong because we want some cool air conditioned room. Okay, and what we have here on my left will be loads of furnish furniture for the house. SB furniture. And, uh, and that's Mitsubishi where we go for our car service either here or Jongchen Patia. And after that is the Home Pro with a big quick and a power buy. And the tall building over there guys is the Holiday Inn Rayong. That's one of the tallest buildings here in Rayong. Very iconic. And the rest are like not too tall, right? Yeah, I also it's... like their um, top bar. Yeah, they have a top bar in there, guys. We've been there a couple of years ago. Yeah. It's also Valentine's. <laughs> yeah. We went there. Yeah. So this guy is here. We are now in Passion Mall. We're gonna go in. This is the Passion Mall beside Holiday Inn. Holiday Inn and entrance to the mall is here or at the back. Let's see. There we go. The guards. Let's go in. in. That's the hotel. This is the entrance to the mall. And those are the shops. Welcome to Lantau. Uh, here. Just window shopping. Yeah. <laughs> you know it's expensive to window shop. How much is the glass panel? That's more expensive. So we are here to shop the windows. <laughs> gonna find our parking maybe down here or okay. somewhere over here here oh okay. lucky lucky yes oh there's a lot there yeah, yeah. but it used to be like very full full parking area but at the moment it's quite open we're gonna park yeah. the car we're gonna park Ching, 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 ching. Okay, we're gonna pass that way or the other way. Mm, this way, maybe that way. Yeah. Okay, all right, all shall right, guys, we? See you in a bit. See you inside. There are some shops that are closed at the moment, guys. Little kinky stuffs. I like it. Okay. Guys, I like this bag because it's so cute. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I like this one too. I like this because it's like it's like cute chic style. I like it. So we're here. We like cute stuff. So now we're gonna find some cute stuff. Let's see if we can have some cute stuff. Okay. Oh. We are inside Mushi Mushi. It's a Japanese company and you can find a lot of good stuff here like a really good quality products right michelle yeah i'm planning to buy the, the mat for for the kitchen see mm -hmm. because our mat in the kitchen is so weird now we're looking let's change some of the mats yeah up to you okay because it looks so weird mm. so how many mats should i buy 
I don't know. We need a couple need of marks. A couple of them. Yeah. This yeah, the fries are, are really good. This one is 89 baht. Yeah. So Let's go to that. <laughs> yeah, that's a good price. Good fair price. price, yeah, fair price. Okay. So, I like to have the orange. That one. One. Two. Three. And I'm so excited to change the doormat later. How many mats do I need? Three? Or two first? Um, maybe three? Yeah. Oh, they are all they are all like light colors. I want something darker. Look guys. Get my mat. So should I have another light color? This orange. Pink. And a bunny. Too pink? How about this one? Yeah, that one. I smile. Yeah. I'm here. So how many you got? You got three? It's 279. Yes. I think our rug needs to be changed anyway. Mm. So now is the time. Cute neck pillows, guys. Oh, you, those are cute. Yeah. I Actually, I need one of this. Okay. I'm gonna put that one on my neck while driving mm -hmm. so I can just sleep while driving. Yeah, it's a crazy thing see. to do, isn't it? <laughs> Me, I'm gonna clean my brush. So I need to have a cleaner. Okay. Step one. Chuk chuk chuk. Step two. This is not how the way you clean your brush. I need to have this new one. Mm hmm. What are these? Brush. These are perfumes. Perfumes. Mm. Try me. Let's smell this one. This is New York. Wait, I don't know. I love New York. Mm. Nice. I smell. Yep, it's like mild. This one is. Uh, Amsterdam? Mm -hmm. No, Tokyo. Oh, it smells good too. This one is. I like their packaging as well there. Yeah. It looks Venice. really expensive. Ooh, but actually, guys. the price is just so cheap. Fair. Yeah. around like Rayong only maybe in the expressway because Thailand has good roads and they are trying to expand the roads and trying to make it look nice and beautiful so as you can see this is a new set of cemented road and we are going to pass by I think this is the underground I'm not sure if this is really the underground it says Banchang there, so we're just gonna follow the Banchang road. Yes, so see how productive Thailand is even though it's in the middle of the pandemic. So guys, as you can see a while ago, we are driving along Sukhumvit Road. There are a lot of improvements. And you know what? Staying here for 13 years, I can really say that Banchang is improving. We've got now the expressway. We are at the end of the expressway and it was supposed to be a quiet town really guys. When I first came over I was like crying along the streets because it's so sad. <laughs> There's only one Tesco and everything is just too quiet. And skip to 13 years later, that is the present day now. We, they are expanding the roads because of the airport. 10 minutes drive from our home and the construction of the Robinson's Mall is underway and will be finished for me I think it will be around two months mm -hmm. when everything is like settled in and all and yes they've got resorts going on they're 
Yeah, they're continuing even though it's a pandemic because people nowadays, guys, they like to go to the beach and so Banchang is one prime location. So, yep, and that is why this road was not here when I came like 13 years ago. Mm. But now it's here, as you can see, the land is being cleared for something big again. I don't know what that is. It might be the industrial side of Banchang. And now, guys, I think you will know by now that Rayong is the industrial industrial area of Thailand, and that's why they cannot shut down. Yeah, the factory is here because this is the lifeline of Thailand. They've got the petrol here and the gasoline. Uh, what do you call that? Companies. Mm. So it's here. Everything is in here. So yep. I hope that you have enjoyed our little, it's not even little, it's like a drive through right? Ooh. Yeah, just oh, a I road block, just a road block. That's a, a so I should be doing a U-turn, right? Yeah, no, not here, uh, all, all the way up, just all the way up here, oh, okay. not here. Oh, oh, yeah, that's only for the motorbike. Mm -hmm. So this will lead to the motorboat area, but we're not going over there, guys. We are going to go and make a U-turn somewhere. Somewhere. Yeah. yeah. Over there. It's there. Okay. Follow the follow other cars. Follow the leader. Yeah, follow the leader. Leaders. And I'm supposed to clean the car, guys. But then I can see there's a bristling ring. So no. Really? Cleaning of cars. See, Is that because I just we just cleaned our car last Monday? Yep. And now it's raining. No. I cannot. Uh, wait. Come on, guys. Okay. This is fun. Mm -hmm. This is really fun. I've got motorbike on my side. And you know, guys, yep, I'm muttering to myself. But this is fun. We are at the back road. When I first come to Banchang, there's no back road. They are still on the process of like redeveloping the back road so that Sukhumvit will not be too much traffic and now the back road is done and now they are rehabilitating Sukhumvit road why is that pickup going through there I don't understand that pickup <laughs> truck but anyway let's go to the back road and yeah you will see that it is a really nice road yeah this is Good. what I've liked about yes. Thailand because they are making the people convenient and give mm, comfort yeah. and that is why this is going to be a big yep. help for their economy yep. so while Richie is taking you on a road tour I must say that this is the only thing that uh, kind of like uh, how do I say that make Thailand more more touristic because of the roads they don't have to like ride planes to go from one end to the other they mm. can just have a road trip guys because it's all inland mm. no need to take a boat or a plane like unlike in the Philippines but what makes Philippines more interesting is because we've got loads of islands we've got different types of sand and a beach and the vibe that's the only thing so that's why expats also like philippines because it's also nice it's really nice they said so some of our friends right at school they said that the sunset in the philippines are quite different from island to island mm. and i have to agree that's the case here guys if you live in the central part of thailand you have to drive five hours or six hours to go to see the beach but in the philippines we've got loads of them right we're almost home so guys this is the end of this episode our third sunday special and sorry i uh, it looks like i was on the roller coaster maybe because of my driver <laughs> but um we hope that you have some fun watching this video and also if you like to share this video please do so because it's gonna be a big help for our channel and we hope to see you again so guys stay safe god bless and stay healthy and see you later peace